Hello, Nikolaj from Ibasa. Today I'm here at the Max Planck Institute in Martinsfeld to follow up on our beta installation. So the team has now been working with our instrument for exactly four months and they've really been super efficient because they've already managed to run almost 4,000 injections. To tell you a little bit more about uh, the experience, Philip Geyer uh, will share some of his data. Hello everyone. Like uh, Nikolai just told you, we uh, have the instrument now for several months and in the beginning we just do some uh, optimizations and play around with the instrument and now we start with more systematic evaluation of the EvoSet prototype. So what we did was we were running now almost 2000 kilo runs and as you can see in the beginning we found some errors but together with Nikolai and Ole we could fix them and for the last 1,500 runs, the error rate dropped down to uh, 0.6%. However, the uh, remaining errors, they look more like blank runs, which you can see here, which we think it's due to loading errors rather than errors with the instrument. And we are still analyzing the data, but as you can see here, the run number one, it looks exactly the same like the run number so 500. And we also did some other experiments, like uh, experiments for cross contaminations. And there we just had a cross contamination rate of 0.03%, uh, which is um, significantly better than uh, with other nano flow HPLCs in our hand. So, all in all, we are very positive with the EvoSet prototype, and we are that positive that we are starting our first clinical study with plasma samples and we are applying our plasma proteome profiling workflow there. So you will hear more from this in the future. Perfect. Thank you very much, Philip. So super encouraging data already and of course it will be even more exciting to see some of the real clinical samples being run on our instrument. So stay tuned and see you next time.